Hello and welcome to day four of Vlogmas. So I'm going to take my picture for Instagram. I usually try to do like a little collage of my look when I actually put a full face of makeup on and I actually did that today. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to show you how I do the Instagram picture in case you guys are curious of the process. But I'm just going to try to do it in like a one take thing. Usually I'll take like a million pictures. I usually do one picture that's from uh, like the middle part of my bottom. So it's like the torso and up. Then one close up of my eye open, close up of my eye closed, and then the lips. Sometimes I rotate it with different things, but that's it for the most part. So I'm going to do the first one where I do most of my face. And I usually do it from this side because it's just easier, comes out better. So and that's the first picture. Then we're going to do the eye. So I usually do this eye, I'm not sure why. So closed or partially closed. I'm going to do it like this. You kind of have to play around with it to get the lighting right. Because sometimes just like moving it from here to here will like drastically change the light and it's crazy. Oh, and then I have to turn it so now I'm facing forward and then open my eye. Right. And the lips. And that's it. That's the process. So I'm going to make a little collage and I'll show you guys real quick. Okay, so here's the collage. Sorry, it's kind of dark right now. I'm against the light. But uh, this is what it looks like. That's horrible. Okay. You can kind of see it if you really want to go see it on Instagram. You can. So um, my name is Purple Stars 1986. If you want to go follow me on there, because I post pictures of makeup looks, pictures of Chewy or random funny pictures. Yeah, anything that's about it. But uh, if you go on there and you follow me, I usually follow pretty much everyone, as long as they're not like a robot, or if you have creepy pictures. <laughs> but uh, that will be up on there. So Instagram, purple stars making six. Okay, so I didn't really do much else today besides uh, finish my paper that was due today, and now I'm making hot chocolate, and I don't know if it's warm enough yet. Oh yeah, it's warm. So I'm going to make the little peppermint hot chocolate that I put on Instagram. And this is a very inexpensive way that I think it still tastes fine, but I know people are probably like, oh my gosh, you are so wrong. So I'm going to put you guys down real quick. Oh, sorry. This packet of hot chocolate and these. And it still tastes like peppermint hot chocolate to me. Then again, I'm not very picky on you guys. Can you see me now? I'm not very picky when it comes to things like that. It's just like Starbucks coffee or anything. It's just it's coffee to me. I get like the, uh, the super sweet things like the ice blended coffees or the frappuccinos or what are they called at McDonald's, the frappes. And it's just like okay like I'll have any of them but I know some people are like oh no this place is better than this place and there's like a whole rivalry or whatever with it so I'm not picky with things like that so last time I like crushed them up really good but it's very late right now so I kind of just crushed them up a little bit and I'm hoping that it'll still work for that one I didn't even crush up at all uh, yeah, it's really late right now, so I don't want to wake up my roommates or people in other apartments for that matter. Because what I did was just get this and then a spoon and turn the spoon this way and hit it to like crack it and sit down and stir it. And I put too much milk in, so it sounds like there's ice in here. That's the peppermint. So I'm going to finish stirring. Wow, so I just watched the footage real quick that I just filmed and my hair was like out of the place, but I'm going to keep it because I can't refilm that because I actually made it right then. But uh, here's the finished thing. Da -da -da -da. Yes. So that is what it looks like. It just looks like regular hot chocolate actually. But uh, remember I put some of the peppermints in and they weren't completely um, crushed, so I'm going to leave it in here in case I need to it lately but I mean it tastes like hot chocolate and peppermint and that's what you want right and these peppermint candies are from Target and they only cost like a dollar and you get a whole bag so that's way cheaper than buying it at Starbucks or buying the hot chocolate mix I think there was a hot chocolate mix at Target and it was like five bucks I'm like uh no 
good. So, I think it tastes fine. But I'm going to drink that right now. I, yeah, just want to thank you guys for all still watching me. Don't forget to comment and just let me know what you think. If you thought something was funny or if you thought something was weird or something was boring. If you guys have any specific uh, tags or challenges or things that you think would be fun to do with like, me and other people and they're not specifically beauty related, then go ahead and let me know because I'm trying to think of things. <laughs> I found a whole bunch of challenges like online, you know, that other people have done on YouTube, but I think the chubby bunny challenge has been done like way too many times. The cinnamon challenge is dangerous. <laughs> I don't know if there's any other challenges you guys want to see, so let me know, otherwise I guess I could try to make up something. And it's already late, it's already after 3, or not after 3, after 2, almost at 3 in the morning, and I'm crazy for doing that, I know. But I'm going to do that, I'm done with finals now, so I'm extremely happy, and as you guys saw, like in the living room, I showed you in the uh, tour of my place, that our walls are pretty empty, and it's... You know, it's December. It's already going to be, like, Christmas soon, so I think I might make some decorations. Might. Because they do have all, like, my papers and posters and all my paints and my brushes and stuff, so I might paint something or draw something, but I don't know. We shall see. As far as tomorrow, I have no idea what's going to happen, so you guys will find out the same time as I do because I really don't have any plans tomorrow since I don't have school or anything to do, anywhere to go. So we shall see. But uh, that's it for today, and I uh, will see you guys tomorrow. All right, bye.